The Separatist Council was made up of the various leaders from the major powers that supported the Confederacy of Independent Systems during the Clone Wars. In canon, 11 members represented organizations including the Trade Federation, the Techno Union, the Intergalactic Banking Clan, and more. It was publicly led by Count Dooku and General Grievous, but Darth Sidious controlled things behind the scenes. The Trade Federation had two Nemoidians on the council. Viceroy Newt Gunray and Settlement Officer Rune Hako were both involved in Darth Sidious' schemes as early as 10 years before the Clone Wars began. They led the blockade of Naboo, which ultimately got Sidious elected as Chancellor of the Republic. Gunray and Hako were arrested, but avoided conviction, probably thanks to their secret but powerful ally. Their early support gained them prominent seats on the Separatist Council. Archduke Poggle the Lesser represented the Geonosians, whose main responsibility was the manufacturing of the battle droids and other machines of war, including the Death Star. Watt Tambor was the foreman of the Techno Union. His organization designed many of the droids and ships used by the CIS. Their inclusion on the council was the most duplicitous, as the Techno Union officially took a neutral stance in the Clone Wars, even having a recognized senator in the Galactic Republic. San Hill was a member of the Intergalactic Banking Clan and the representative for the Financial Cartel. They also played both sides in the war. They pledged their support to the Separatists, but continued business with the Republic, although at much steeper interest rates. The Republic responded with an invasion, taking control of the banks. Despite the loss of power, Sand Hill remained a member of the Separatist Council. Pascal Argente was the magistrate of the Corporate Alliance. Outside of offering their resources, little is known about what the Corporate Alliance actually contributed to the Confederacy. Their organization was one of the few to actually survive beyond the Clone Wars and the Galactic Republic's transition into the Galactic Empire. Shu Mai was the president of the Commerce Guild. They provided the Dwarf Spider Droid and the Recusant class Light Destroyer to the war effort. Poe Nudo and Tix were Republic senators who left the Senate in support for independence. An Aqualish and a Quarren, respectively, their actions earned them each seats on the council. After the deaths of both Dooku and Grievous, the Separatist Council fled to Mustafar. With his plan complete and finding no further use for them, Sidious ordered his Sith apprentice Darth Vader to slaughter them all. Each member was killed, and their organizations were either dissolved, absorbed by the Empire, or restructured to continue under Imperial rule. That's it for today. Please subscribe, like, and share to see new Star Wars videos every weekday. And if there's a specific Star Wars topic you'd like me to cover, leave it in the comments and I'll do an episode about it. As always, thank you for watching, and may the Force be with you.